to open up a brand new shop. That is correct. Yep. Your first shop. My first shop. Yep. Here in Midland. Congratulations. In Midland. Yep. Now where where is that at? It is on James Savage Road. Um, I took a towing company's facility, and we are brand new. Um, been in business since 2008. Okay. And um, ready to take over and do some good work for the Midland community. Now, the reason why we brought you on the show was, for one, you're a Christian. Number two, yep. the, the name of your business, Higher Standards, how did you come up with that? Um, my friend and I, we had wanted to start um, a business together, and we were trying to toss up different names. And uh, Higher Standards was basically trying to say meant in the name of how we wanted to take care of it our customers okay. and to establish a work ethic um, so basically it was trying to put something out there that would say we have to live up to that very good integrity yes, exactly. exactly and you're a faith man too yes we are I've known you for about a year and a half now you're a very good man family I've been to your house um, I know your family um, now when now it's about the faith thing you you're operating in faith yes we and are. and you also go to what celebration center christian celebration Christmas. center yep this is my home church that's your home church and so basically you're i like to i asked you earlier about what uh, what are some give us our, our viewing audience we we're running out of time get better at this as we go but uh, a tip get a little thing that you know can help our viewers you know um jump in the to to help prevent, save them some money. Prevent money. You're the man. Um, probably the biggest thing that I see on cars today is lack of maintenance and repairing vehicles before they actually break and cost major repair. For example, like a transmission service. Most people don't realize those services have to be done within 30,000 miles to protect the transmission from wear, um, excessive heat. You're getting things. a big problem. So you're not you're not looking at a three thousand dollar job or a two thousand dollar job. Instead, you're looking at a couple hundred dollars at the most. Um, simple maintenance is like those protect and Oils, save you waters, money. And like coolants, um, like okay. coming in the summertime, a coolant is either full. Um, right. That's probably one of the main, main reasons with coolant systems. We don't see them full when they come in the shop, so they're not accurately cooling like they're supposed to. So just having even coming in for regular maintenance checks, um, these are fun or easy to do, but they don't necessarily check all those fluids and make sure that you're working at 100% every time. So, so, so basically, if we go to higher standards, you know, I, I, that's where I take my vehicle. But if I, if those were to, mm. uh, they're going to get some integrity. They're going to get some. They're going to get some real. Truth. We're going to be honest, and and that's what we're looking. You for may not always show. like what you hear, but I'm going to yeah. be honest with you. Right. And uh, trying to bring the honesty back into the into the repair facilities That's is the biggest like thing. We need it. That's yeah. a big reason why people, they don't like to take their car in because, oh, the mechanic, they're just going to say we need this and this and this, when really we don't. Exactly. Right. So I'm, nice I'm not here. I'm here to make money, but I'm trying to do it honestly. And save and, people money. And save people money on the other end um, is how I look at it. So this is a, uh, you had a passion to do this. This is like a... Uh, kind of your thing of giving back. I've been doing this in the community for 15 years. Um, I worked at five different facilities throughout this place. I've been in the community as a master certified technician. Okay. And to find the honesty and um, the truthfulness on the repair, faci repair facility side is why I eventually said I need to do this myself because they're just never where I went. It was not there. And I refused to work for people that would <clears> not. Okay. Higher place. standards. Higher standards comes in. So exactly. now I know where to take my car to. <laughs>